What's up, you guys? It's your boy, Felipe. And, you know, interestingly enough, recently I'm getting a lot of DMs about what my real estate strategy is. So let's get started. like this channel, go ahead and subscribe, leave me a like or a comment so that I can make more videos of the things you like. So what is Felipe's strategy? I feel like a lot of the people that I mentor and coach, especially in Rat Race to Fi, which is my mastermind, a lot of people don't realize that there is way more strategies than just Burr and the 1%. I'll tell you how many. There is so many strategies that there is an individual strategy for every person that has an individualized goal for their real estate investment. My goals are not the same as the next investor next to me, which is why real estate costs so much different and people buy in at different prices because people have different strategies. So which strategy works best for you? I don't know, but I do know which one works best for me. And that's established by the goal that I put for myself, which is this. I want the most amount of cash flow for the least amount of properties that allows me to be home every day by one o'clock. If my property that I buy does not allow me to be home by one o'clock, if it affects that goal, then I'm not buying it. If I have two rental properties that are both the exact same square footage, exact same price in the exact same neighborhood with the exact same numbers, but one cash flow is a little bit more than the other, I am going to go not based on any other thing than which one is going to take up least of my time. That is Felipe's goal. That is my investing strategy. Plain and simple. I don't burr. I don't HELOC. I don't use all these crazy strategies that you hear about, which are tailored to individually that person's goal. Felipe's goal is the least amount of properties with the most amount of cash flow that does the least amount of my time. I want to be home by one o'clock every day for that guy. That's it. What is your goal? Why do you do this? Why do you want to invest in real estate? Figure out that and use that as your common denominator as to why you're going to buy that rental property. Don't just say for the money. That's the worst reason that you can buy a rental property. You need to buy a rental property with the common denominator of your goal. And this is what we teach in Rat Race to Fi, my, my private mastermind group, because we find that a lot of people don't get involved in real estate because they don't have an established goal. <laughs> Here's another thing. They hate their job because they're not leveraging their job against real estate. They're like, I can't wait to quit. And I'm like, that's, that's not the right way to think about it. Because the moment you quit, you lose the bankability. I instead tell them, hey, look, why don't you create an LLC with your side hustle of passion while you're working? Your LLC starts making money for those two years that you're left in your job. You acquire as many loans as you can against real estate in those two years. And then when you quit, you've established an LLC with two years of work experience in it. And now you can start borrowing money against the LLC. If you quit your job today and then open your LLC, not only do you put yourself back two years because your LLC has to be established, banks aren't going to trust you because your LLC doesn't have two years established. So the reason people hate their jobs is because they don't have a reason to be there. But if you give yourself a reason to be at your job, that's going to be the reason you're able to get loans and stuff. Then you can quit your job after two years of bankability with your LLC and pulling as many loans as you can towards real estate when you are in your job. All of a sudden, you don't hate your job because you're using it against real estate, right? So establish your goal, use your job to help you reach that goal and real estate and an LLC, eventually quitting your job to buy more real estate through your LLC. That is my business strategy. That is how I invest in real estate. I invest for cash flow that gives me back my time. I don't care about numbers of how many units I have. I care more about the time that each unit gives me. And that's it, guys. That's my strategy. No secret. If you love the channel, go ahead and give me a like, subscribe to the channel, and leave me a comment if you have any questions. I'll make videos about whatever you want. Thanks, guys.